Hello, hi, and welcome to Meaningful Mondays with me, Rashmi Shetty, a space where I share my life lessons. And yesterday was the last season, last race. And what a race. What amazing life lessons were present. Not a Formula One fan, but then sat down to watch because it was poised on a beautiful start. For the second time, since the first season of Formula One way back from 1950, where two drivers in the race evenly poised with 369.5 points. So this at the starting of the race. While one, Lewis Hamilton, was already world number one, having a record to his credit for having equaled Michael Schumacher's a record of seven world titles, Four in a row, he was gunning for his eighth world title. Huge experience behind him. And the one he was even with was a 24-year-old Dutch driver for whom, if he won the race, this would have been his maiden trophy. At the young age of 24, Max Verstappen was somebody who everyone was eager to watch. It was an amazing race from the word go and nobody was surprised that Lewis Hamilton had a lead through and through. But things changed towards the last few laps. There was a crash, a safety car that came in and the race had to slightly halt before it took off again for the last few laps. And the decider was in the last lap where Max Verstappen was able to take that slight edge over Hamilton and never allowed him to take over after that to become the first Dutchman ever at the age of 24 to be the new Formula One champion in this race finale of 2021. Amazing. But even in victory, what I loved was the way he acknowledged everything around him. Yes, yes, yes was what he told his team. It got off his vehicle and knelt down to say a thank you. It was beautiful that in the height of that emotion, where his dream was only to be a Formula One driver, and then today stand with the trophy, the podium, and also be the world's best. How amazing is that contribution and that combination? His entire team he thanked, but then was also humble in acknowledging that he never expected this. Post the race in the interview, he very candidly said that it was a roller coaster, you know, from no chance of winning to everything coming together. A very sweet way of acknowledging how it was beyond him that he emerged the champion. And when you look back and you see the entire trajectory of this race, there were a lot for us to understand. The most important being that it's never over till it's over. So never give up till the very end. Perez, his teammate from Red Bull, had made sure that Lewis Hamilton was completely putting his best shot there and kept the race going between the two of them till he handed it over to Max very beautifully to finish. So as a team player, well, never underestimate your contribution. Every bit counts for the individual to win the race and the trophy and the crown may go to one person but there's a whole team behind it and I remember reading this passage where there's this lovely uh, story where a little child looks up to God and says that if everything is already written in destiny why should I even wish so God smiled at the little kid and said that 
maybe in some pages I have written as you wish. And yesterday I saw that coming true. Maybe in yesterday's page of Max's life, he had wished that he win the race. A bizarre wish, but that was that page of his life where God said, as you wish. <laughs> and it kind of satiated that curiosity that I was carrying that does it actually happen? And another beautiful life lesson that I picked up was that there can be unexpected surprises in many of these races of life. So just because you're competing with the best, there is no rule that the best should always win. Put out your best and the rest will just take over. So amazing four life lessons were never ever give up till it's over. Second, it is never underestimate your contribution as a team player to whatever you're part of. And be careful what you wish because that particular day of your life could be that page of your life where it is as you wish. And fourthly, there is no rule that only the best should win. So when you get down on the race, remember the racing track is just a fresh race each time. And never go there with the attitude of anyway, the best will win. What have your takeaways been from the race if you watched it? Do let me know. Have a meaningful, purposeful week ahead. Stay safe. Stay blessed.